I'm here at the port of Oakland with a group that's protesting the departure of this ship that is planning to deliver weapons to Israel um, in support of the, the genocide of innocent people in Gaza. The community became aware that the ship was headed to Israel to carry military cargo to the apartheid state of Israel because of the courage of crew members who decided not to take this job. The goal is to get the, um, the ship workers to stand in solidarity with uh, the, the movement of, of people who are concerned about the shipment of weapons. So the fact that there's one worker walking off the ship, we hope that's the start of uh, a trend and that other workers will come to see that their labor is being exploited in, uh, uh, you know, towards the purpose of genocide. So the goal is to get a full walkout if we can. So there's a range of uh, groups that have been protesting uh, the ongoing genocide of the people in Gaza. Um, some of them are groups of concerned Arab Americans. Some of them are groups of concerned um, Jewish Americans. I myself am Jewish, and I've been working with uh, certain organizations that uh, you know are are fighting uh, the the genocide being committed and are still very. Um, out of our Judaism and don't see this as a reflection of Judaism. Yeah, I mean, I think people are committed to being out here for as long as they need to be. Um, you know, there was a thought that the, the ship might have left already by now, and it's really heartening to see that it hasn't. So, you know, people are energized, there's coffee, there's bagels, people are, are supporting each other, and people are ready to stay out here for hours if needed.